perfect dinner date, there are few things that you need to keep in mind and a few things that you need to follow. Number one, a menu which is a plan. China wear and good linen. Some mood music. Determination. And most importantly, a relaxed state of mind. <sighs> Warm up your love life. Trigger your feel-good buttons and cook to impress. While you want it delicious, you don't want to make it so elaborate that you're spending all night in the kitchen and not in the bedroom. I'm a great believer in the term Nisa Plus. Everything in its place. Plan ahead, prep ahead and you will sail through the meal. The aim today is to impress. No run of the mill stuff is going to be accepted. When you were cooking for your friends, it was experiment, it was fun, it was blase. But today, there is no scope for mistake. I'm not trying to scare you. What we're going to do is anyway so simple, but it'll look great. We will do some artichoke hearts with parmesan, followed by some meat skewers and then some voluptuous, sensuous panna cotta. Today is the day when you are going to be pronounced the kitchen god or the kitchen goddess. Your love is going to be bowled over. I promise you that. So, what are we waiting for? Let's start with the artichoke with parmesan followed with corsini. Get a pan warming up with a little bit of olive oil, a dash of butter. Again, I mean choice is yours. You could do it only in olive oil or half butter, half olive oil. It depends what you feel like doing. Butter always makes things taste nicer. But we also have a aim and the aim is to keep the food light. So what I'm going to do is do half olive oil, half butter. Once the butter is sizzling, like the state of your mind, add some onions. A little bit of salt, some chopped parsley. And whilst the onion turns pink, I'm going to roughly chop the artichoke. I think artichokes are just such fantastic vegetables. It's a shame we still don't get uh, the full with leaves and what we really get here is just the heart in oil or in brine. But uh, I do believe some people have started growing them in India. It's, it's, this vegetable is actually fun vegetable. It's, not, it's a bit like eating crab where there is a ceremony, there is a ritual whilst eating it as well as whilst you're preparing it. So there we go, adding some artichoke to the pan. A little bit of cheese, parmesan is what I prefer but it's up to you again, you want to use some blue cheese, you want to use some goat cheese, just a little bit to give it a body. Add some cream, just a wee bit, not too much. Okay, just a little wee bit more maybe. And there. Here we are doing the artichokes over crostini. There are hundreds of other ways you could do it. You could just do the artichoke hearts by itself, marinated in some oil serve with some dips. Uh, you could do it just with parmesan shavings. Okay. 